Hello and welcome to another episode of Staking Recipes. My name is Alan and today I'll be walking you through how to stake PancakeSwap on the Binance Smart Chain. To start with, I would advise you to familiarize yourself with the PancakeSwap earn page on stakingrewards.com where you'll be able to get a bit more information about what PancakeSwap is, see the historical price as well as the current market cap, stake value and what percentage of eligible tokens are being staked currently. You can also see what kind of staking options there are for PancakeSwap and the reward rate as well as the adjusted reward rate. The adjusted reward rate is a reward deducting the inflation rate, which means that if you were to stake for one year, your share of the market would go up by 23%. Scrolling down further to the website, you'll be able to see a nice little tool where you can estimate your monthly earnings. So let's assume we invest $1,000 into PancakeSwap, stake it for one year, set the price at a bullish 50%, assuming PancakeSwap goes up 50% over the next year. Uh, you can see here that your monthly earnings will then be $62.66. And for one year, this will be $762.33. Not too bad for investment of $1,000. Scrolling down further, you have a few FAQs explaining what PancakeSwap is, why it was launched, and the team behind it, as well as some information about the staking behind it. Uh, further down, you'll be able to go to the How to Stake Cake on PancakeSwap tutorial in our journal. To be able to stake PancakeSwap, you'll first need to install MetaMask on your Google Chrome browser. To do so, search for MetaMask on Google, go to the link here, the chrome.google.com uh, app store, and for you, it would say add to Chrome. Once you have downloaded MetaMask and installed it successfully, you'll be asked to create an account. I'm gonna call mine Staking Recipes. Once created, you'll see your empty wallet here. If you go to the top, just under the name of the wallet, if you click on that, you'll be able to copy the wallet address and use that for transferring any funds onto uh, your wallet. Once you have added some BNB to your wallet, you'll see your balance here. As you can also see, I currently do not have any cake tokens on my wallet, and I will therefore have to go and buy some. To do so, you can go to the Pancakes of the Finance website, click on Trade, convert BNB to cake. Let me convert 0.2 BNB, estimated 8.5 cake that I will receive. Slippage, I would prefer to set that to around half a percent. You swap, you will have a confirmed transaction in your wallet. Once a transaction has been successful, you will see your BNB balance down by the 0.2 that I paid for it. And you can also see my cake balance has gone up from zero to 8.5. Navigating back to PancakeSwap, if you go to earn pools and search for cake, you'll be able to see the different types of cake staking you can do. The one I typically go for is the auto cake. This one auto compounds your rewards every epoch, which means that you just sit, wait, and reap the rewards. To start staking, you would have to enable the pool by clicking enable, confirm the transaction in your MetaMask, wait for the transaction to be confirmed. In this window, you can pick how many tokens you would like to stake. I'm going to be staking all of them. You can see your annual RRI at current rates will be roughly $62 based on the eight and a half cake I have staked. Confirm, confirm a transaction in your MetaMask. And once the transaction has been confirmed on chain, you will be successfully staking cake. Once the transaction has been confirmed, you will now see your cake staked is 8.52 tokens, which is roughly $92.9. You also see some information regarding the withdrawal fees. If you unstake within 72 hours of staking, you'll be charged 0.1% unstaking fee. The performance fee is also subtracted from your rewards. This is just a fee that goes to Pancake for allowing you to auto compound your rewards. To unstake your tokens, you can press on the minus button, enter the balance you would like to unstake, confirm it, confirm it again in your MetaMask and wait for the unstaking transaction to go through. Once the transaction has gone through, if you now go back to MetaMask, you'll see you got your 8.51 cake back. This is the 8.52 we had minus the 0.1% withdrawal fee that we had to pay for withdrawing early. As you can see, staking PancakeSwap is very simple one of the simplest staking methods you can have. 
And yeah, all the best in your staking journey and see you next week.